Happening today, sentencing for the woman captured on cell phone video stabbing a passenger on a Detroit bus. Our Nick Monticelli is live for us this morning following this story. And uh, Nick, this was all started as a disagreement that turned violent and unfortunately deadly. A disagreement, Evrod, over a woman who was apparently swearing near children. So all of that played out on the bus and the stabbing. It all will end here at the Frank Murphy Hall of Justice, where the defendant will finally be sentenced. She'll find out how long she will serve in prison. This is the cell phone video that grabbed many headlines last summer, showing a fight which led to a stabbing, killing a 50-year-old woman on a DDOT bus. It did get physical until the older lady took her wardrobe by trying to exit and she shoved it towards the um, other lady. During the trial, witnesses shared their version of the story, many which said the argument was between three women and lasted about 20 minutes. The victim is Charlotte Williams wearing white, the defendant, Tiffany Edwards, wearing black. She has now been found guilty of involuntary manslaughter. Witnesses say it started when a mother took exception with the victim's foul language around children and escalated when she bumped the defendant with her walker as she tried to get off. I think clearly we see that uh, Ms. Edwards was defending herself. She was on the bus. She was attacked by an object that was being used as a weapon, and she did what she thought was necessary to defend herself at that time. It isn't very clear in the video, but the attack is happening. Witnesses say Williams was badly bleeding. You can see her hand appear with blood on it. She was actually still trying to swing and punch, and she got up, like, she was trying to speak, but it was blood coming off her cheek. The video then ends as you see Edwards charging once more. <laughs> Now, the sentencing is scheduled for 9 a.m. in front of Judge Cynthia Hathaway again here at the Frank Murphy Hall of Justice. We, of course, will be inside to let you know what happens. We're live in Detroit. Nick Monticelli, Local 4 News Today.